Hi besties, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by again. Or if you're new here, hi, my name is Jen and I do Timu hauls mainly. So thank you so much for stopping by and looking at my haul and seeing what I got. I have a couple of things. That I have like such a mishmash. It's very random today. I think I saw jewelry in here, a couple pieces of clothing, home decor, outdoor stuff, all kinds of things. So it's going to be like super random, which we love. We love a random haul, don't we? We love it. We're here for it. So, okay, let's just get right into this. Um, by the way, I will leave the links to everything down below or a link to my whole order, but it'll probably be individual links. Probably, I'm guessing maybe, uh, because the local warehouse stuff seems to always ship separate, so we ha it has like a separate link. Um, my affiliate code's down there. My affiliate link is down below. Um, if you're new to Timu, hi. I'm, I'm sure you probably know about Timu by now. Um, so I love Timu. I shop on there all the time. I've never had any issues with them. I've been shopping on there for a year. No one's ever stole my information. Um, I've never had a problem with returns. You get one free return per order. And so, yeah, it's like super simple. I find a lot of great items on there. I always read the reviews and I always look through every single picture on the listing. I have noticed that when I do that, I've changed my mind about items. <laughs> and what I mean is like, so I'll see a jewelry item or a clothing item. And then I like start skipping through the pictures and I'm like, by the fourth or fifth picture, I'm kind of like, mm, I don't know about this because I feel like the first picture might kind of be a catfish <laughs> picture. So just make sure you read the reviews on everything. Make sure you're looking at all the pictures on the ad. And um, if you don't like something, return it. Don't forget to do your price adjustments. You can do them before it even ships to you. I, I placed an order yesterday. I've already got a price adjustment on. So make sure you check your price adjustments like every couple of days because you can check, you know, you can do them more than once for every order. So please make sure to check those, get some money back. All right, let's just get into this. That's my spiel. So, okay. First item is like a kitchen item. This was 314. This item is something you set like across the side of your sink uh, to like maybe you maybe you just use your favorite coffee mug. It looks like this. It's like supposedly it's stainless steel and this is like silicone, but you sit this like across the edge of one of your sinks. And, uh, you know, let's say, I, I know I have like a favorite coffee cup I use or a favorite glass I always drink out of. So instead of me putting it in the dishwasher, I, I can just wash it out, sit it on here and it'll drip dry, you know, or you can set anything on here, like, you know, whatever, whatever you need to drain, I guess you can put on this, but that's what it's for. It just sits right on the corner of your sink. So I thought that was kind of handy. Um, so for 314 and it, you can fold it up and put it away and, that's that. So I thought that was pretty handy for $3.14. Okay, so the next couple items are th a couple things that I showed actually in my last haul. It's it's these flag holders, like the yard garden flags, and they were 407. Are they both 407? Yes. So I'm going to set this one down here cuz this one is actually open. Sorry for the noise. But it looks like this, and I showed this in my last haul. It's literally just a flag holder. Nothing special, too special about it, except for, okay, so you get this piece right here that'll go on the, um, you know, the long part where the flag is, and it, it your flag attaches here so that it doesn't, like, blow around or blow over and get stuck on, you know, on, like, the top. So that's why I like this. But, yeah, for $4.07 for those flag Holders. I thought that's a pretty good deal because I feel like I bought them off of Amazon and they were way more expensive than that. So I don't know. Okay, the next items, and these are the same, but I'm going to do them both because so every once in a while, oh, sorry I'm, if the camera's moving, every once in a while on Timu, I will get some type of a. I don't want to call it a spin the wheel deal, but it'll say, oh, you get you can get 90% off an item if you buy $40. You get three free items if you spend $40. Well, I always fall for it every time. So I got two of these. Oh, sorry. Um, this is a, a candle in here, a battery operated candle, just like this one behind me here, only it's gray. I got this one for $5.97, which is a steal. And then regularly, they're about $17.55, which still isn't bad because I checked on Amazon today 
And some of these were right around 17, but they went all the way up to $28. So, wow. Um, I put batteries in one of these so I could show it to you. But I love these. I love the way they look. They, they look so realistic, like the flickering of the candle. And the cool thing about them is they have a remote control. Sorry, I'm, I'm going to open this down here so the table doesn't move around. But um, I hope this is the one I put the batteries in. Now, these ones I bought in gray. So this one back here is in white. No, actually, it's the other one. Figures. Figures, I would open this one and it's the other one. Okay, hold on. They're both the same. But yeah, these come in different colors, but I, I've only seen them in gray and white on Timu. And I'm sorry, the table's shaking. Let me get this one out of here. Only I would open the wrong one. But this is what they look like. Okay. All right, so... Here's what it looks like. This is not glass. It's actually like acrylic, but it looks like glass. I mean, it, it really does look like glass. So this is what it looks like. You put in three AA batteries in the bottom. It comes with this remote. And so as you can see on the remote, you can turn it off and on. You can only have, if you want to, you can only put it on for like two hours, four hours, six hours, eight hours. It can go in candle mode and light mode and you can dim it and uh, turn it up. So I'm going to turn it on. So this is what it looks like in the candle mode. It's really pretty. It looks like flickering. So if I hit light, it just goes like, you know, there's no flickering at all. I personally like the flickering. So let's put it back on flickering. I just think they're really, really super pretty. Um, well worth 17 to be honest, but they look so realistic, but I love that it has the remote and I love that you can like put it on for a couple hours and then, but like this even feels like real wax. So it's very, very realistic. Really love these. I, I absolutely love having candles around in this way. You don't have to worry about burning down your house or, you know, your kids sticking their hand in there and getting hurt. So I feel like for that it's worth it and like I said I really like this one back here I use it and I use it all the time and I have many candles in my house that are not real <laughs> and then I always put some kind of wax melt in or something if I want scent somewhere okay this is next it is a multifunctional window cleaner did I put a price on this oh 578 for this um, I think I was going to use this to clean my screens, not so much my windows, or try to use it to clean my screens, because it shows that you can do that on here somewhere. Where is it? I thought, oh, well, on the side it says clean and scrape glass, or, or well, really you can use anything, clean your tub, I mean, all kinds of things on there, that it's giving you, like, all different kinds of ideas and whatnot, but I was going to use it on my screens, um... So it's got this, this feels like it's a little bit scrubby, but not like too, too much. You get this brush as well that goes in the bottom of this. So let's put this thing together. I think that's where it goes. I'm having a heck of a time getting this together. I'll have to have Brian put this together, but so here's the top and here, hopefully the top goes on better. Yeah. It just like snaps in right here. And then you have this little, oh, the little brush goes on the back right here. So that's cool. You stick the little brush right in here. So it's there if you need it. I think that's where that goes, I'm assuming. Yes. So it's got a squeegee right here, and you so you can clean your glass and then squeegee it. I was going to actually use this to clean, like, the screens in my windows as well. So we'll see how it works. But this goes on here, too, so you can extend it. But that part is so hard to get on. I don't know. I'm going to have to have Brian, like, mess with that and see if he can get it on. But, yeah. Feels like it's going to scrub and clean. So I was just hoping, like, you know how screens get dirty and you just kind of want to clean them off so hopefully it'll work but yeah five seven no i'm sorry 548 for that item okay next in my bag of goodies is this now i got this for 6.98 this was another one of those local warehouse items and i'm not i don't know if i'm too crazy about it it literally didn't come in a box or anything like oh did someone return this or you know like it's solar lights um these are like solar kind of like fairy lights and then it comes with you know the piece you put in the ground and then you can put the solar thing you know on this if you're gonna put it in the ground so that it gets the light but what is it with me and putting stuff together today okay there it goes all right so that you know the stake can go in the grass and then you can put this wherever you want let's see if these will light up or not I might have to cover okay yeah they do so there's what they look like 
it's just some fairy lights and they twinkle or you can put them on different modes so they do like different things they can flash or whatever you know however you want to do it so yeah i don't know i thought it was kind of weird it just came in a bag though like there's no box or nothing for this at all I don't know. Just kind of thought that was weird, but $6.98 for that. I don't know why I bought that. Who knows? I like putting lighting outside, and guys, I'm having a hot flash so bad that my glasses are fogging up. Whew. Okay. Literally, my glasses are fogging up. Okay. Now, I got this for free. Um, this is prob this was probably one of, one of those items where it was like, uh, spend $40, get a couple of free items. So I, I had this in my cart anyways. It's a little ring. Okay, so it is a cross, and then it's it's a wee tiny cross, and then it's got a couple of, you know, cubic zirconia around it. I thought it was just really, really pretty. Let me show it this way so you can, like, kind of see it. I didn't want to do it upside down, but... So that's what it looks like. I just thought it was, like, super pretty. I really like it, but I got it for free, and I had it in my cart anyways, so... And then when I did, I, I, I think that's how I got those candles and then this ring and maybe that other item for like cheaper. It was like, you know, spend 40 bucks and get two or three items for free. So that's what I did. Okay, next are these socks. These were a steal, okay? <laughs> a big steal. So these were 87 cents for this whole bag of socks. Um, and they're five pairs. I think I saw somebody else get these too, but I can't remember because it's been a while. But they are so stinking cute because they are bee themed. And we, you know, we, we know I love bees. So you have this pair. It's like a dark gray kind of black with yellow. And then you have this yellow pair with the little bee on top. Then you have this pair. Really cute. This pair is also really cute. It's got little beehives on it. And then this is this pair is really cute, too. It's just got some yellow um, buffalo check, I guess you could call it. So, yeah, all five of those for $0.87. Cents. Okay, next is this uh, necklace. It was $1.61. It's really pretty. It's gold, but it's really pretty. It's got, like, the... Uh, let me turn it so it can face you. But... It's got the little, like, Van Cleef and Arpel little clovers on it. Well, this one's backwards over here. But hopefully you can see them. They're black, and then they have some rhinestones in the center. They're like a black enamel. Really pretty. I just, it's, it's probably going to be one of those necklaces you're going to have to mess with all day to get it to stay the right way. But they're really, really pretty. It's just a necklace with all of these on it. And they just don't want to stay the right direction. Yeah, those little Van Cleef and Arpel type of things. So yeah, $1.61 for that. It's really nice and weighty. It feels like it's really, really good quality. So yeah, I'm happy with that for $1.61. Okay, next is this bracelet. I think I got a couple of these in like the different colors. Um, they're like a rattan kind of bracelet. This one was $2.39, but I'm going to tell you right now, it was not worth $2.39. It's really, really um, light, which is which is fine, but it's just, I don't know, it's kind of cheap. I mean, well, it's $2.39, so I guess, I guess it is kind of cheap, right? But, I mean, I don't know. It's okay. Like, I think I bought a couple of these to kind of do, like, a bracelet stack, but I don't know. I'm just not super crazy about it. Maybe it depends on the outfit you wear. You know, like maybe if you have some type of like boho kind of natural looking top on, you know, that'd be really cute with that. Or maybe denim potentially, but $2.39 for this, mm, I don't know. I feel like that's a little bit on the high side for that. Okay, I got this for work. It's a mouse pad. <laughs> it, I don't even know. Oh, it was $1.12. Wow, okay, that's a bargain. $1.12. And this is funny because I always send the guys at work this meme with this this guy on it. So, and it's like, this is fine. And like, everything is on fire in the back. Like, it's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. I think that's hilarious. So yeah, a buck twelve for that. I thought that was a bargain. So can't wait to show the guys at work that. And then, so I got these earrings for $1.18. And the backs are bent, of course. I mean, why wouldn't they be, right? I don't know. I hate that they don't put them in something when they send them but anyway you know here we are so this says s925 on it like but they're not silver they're like gold so i don't i don't know i don't know anyway they're little cherries i thought they were adorable just really cute little cherries 
it's sparkle i just thought they were cute they're not the greatest but they were only a dollar 18 so what do i expect right i think one of the cats is down here i can yep Kermy, is that you or delilah I'm not sure who it is i can feel them rubbing on my leg okay then i got this like cleaning brush it was only a dollar seven which i thought was a great deal i mean you can't even get a, a brush to clean at the dollar tree anymore for that price and so it comes with this but i don't know what the heck this is for somebody oh you know what it's like little it's like little kind of like tweezers like if you have to pick something up that maybe you don't want to i don't know if it snaps in here or what i'm I'm, assume, I'm assuming that it does yeah it does it like snaps in there you can hang it up it's got like a crevice brush and then there's like this brush you can like clean i would say your like bathroom grout or your toilet or something like that but for a buck seven it's a nice brush i think it's i think it's really nice so not mad at that Okay, I think I have bought these earrings before, but they were $1.75, or if I bought them, maybe they were in a different color, potentially, but I really like them. Um, they're like the enamel-looking earrings. They look like this. They're like pink and like a dark, they're like a dark pink and like a hot pink. They would match my glasses, and then they do have some rhinestones on them. But yeah, they're like $1.75, and these also come in, like, black and white, and I think there's, like, a teal, which I'm pretty sure I bought. But, yeah, they're just really pretty. I really like them. I mean, for $1.75, that's a great pair of earrings. Really like them. Okay, next is this bracelet. It was $4.38. Oh, my gosh. That's a lot for me to spend, but it's really cute. I don't know if this... Okay. Let me figure this out. Oh, okay. That's why those are on there. Maybe they're supposed to come off or stay on. I don't know. Maybe you guys can tell me. So it's a bead bracelet. It's like almost like a watch band type of bracelet, but it's got this really cute bee on the front right here. If I could get it to focus, but it's got these like two things along the side. And I don't know if that's actually to keep the bee in place or if, if you're supposed to take them off. Do you think they're supposed to take them off? I don't know. But it's really, really cute. I, I really like it. That's what it looks like on. Really cute. But for $4.38, mm, I don't know. I think you, I don't know. I think you're supposed to leave these on so the bee doesn't slide off. But it kind of looks weird with just like a bee and then it's got like these plastic things around it. I don't know. You tell me. Do you think the plastic is supposed to come off or not? I'm not sure. I don't know. Okay, so I got these nails. I have got these nails before. They are $2.99. They're handmade nails. Um, I always get everything in a size medium. They look like this. They're the really like, I don't know, what would you call these? Aurora Borealis cat eye kind of look. They've got like blue and pink and silver and all kinds of different colors. They're just really, really pretty. And I like the length for work. So yeah, I think they're like super duper pretty. $2.99 for, I mean, a manicure, that's that's great. These are also Timu nails. They're the ones I bought in one of my last hauls, and I said, I hope these fit my fingers because they're really, really small, and I was right. They are really, really small. They literally just fit my fingernails, which is fine because, you know, they're not long at all. Okay, here's another one of these rattan kind of bracelets. This one was $3.19. I mean, no, absolutely not. Like, this is probably five cents worth of rattan, maybe. No. I mean, they're not horrible. I just don't really like them. They're very light. <laughs> if you like a lightweight bracelet, yes. I just, maybe you just have to have the right outfit. But yeah, this one was $3.19 though. I feel like that's, I feel like that's way too much for those. I would not buy those ever again for that amount. No stinking way. Okay, so this was a free bracelet. Um... I feel like I maybe have got this before, but it's a, like a hammered gold cross and then it's got these beads which are not real they're like acrylic beads so kind of glad it was free but yeah they're not real beads because they're they're definitely plasticky so i don't know i mean it's okay it's not the best but it was free so you know there's that but anyway it's pretty so and it was free <laughs> so i'll keep it all right next is this what is it it's, it was 227 Oh, it's like a hairline powder or eyebrow powder. I always use these for my eyebrows because um, I stamp my eyebrows on. I did a get, rid of, get Ready With Me a while back where I showed you guys how I did that. If you're looking for that video, if you go back, let me get something to open this. 
um, I did like one get ready with me with Team Move products and I stamped my eyebrows and I put on lashes in that video too. So if you want to know how or what lashes I put on or how to put them on, it's in that video. So this is like a hairline shadow pen cover stick and I got it in the color 90, which don't know what, what color 90 is. I'm sorry, it's not 90. It's actually 6. I mean, it could be 90 if you look at it that way, but it's telling me it's number six. So it is number six. I like to use these on my eyebrows. Like I, I use this as eyebrow powder mainly. So let's see kind of what the color is. It's like a ashy kind of brown. So it looks like that. So that's nice. It would be good with this color hair. You know what I mean? And I wear wigs all the time, so I have to change my eyebrows up every now and then, depending on what color hair I'm wearing that day. Yeah, so there is that. All right, so, yeah, it looks like it's going to work really, really well. Um, and I think I remember them saying this might be, like, water waterproof, maybe. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. But, yeah, looks like it's good quality. So we will check it out, and we will try it out. All right, next, let's pull out this. More earrings. These were 98 cents, and I thought they were adorable for 98 cents. They're like white apples. They're like apple earrings, and they're like a, like an iridescent color, and then they've got some rhinestones at the top. Really stinking pretty. Really cute. They, these would be really cute on a little girl, too, but I just thought they were really pretty. So I think I've actually bought more than one set of these. So if I did, I'll put them in a giveaway. But they were only 98 cents. So stinking cute for 98 cents. Heck yeah. All right. Next is this shirt. Um, it is a Fleetwood Mac shirt. A t-shirt. Or a, I mean a tank top. I got it in a 5XL. I like all my clothes really big, especially tank tops. It was $8.48. I'll put a picture of it up on the model as well so you can see what it looks like on. But I love this thing. If you like your tank tops to feel like tank tops, it, this this is it. It doesn't feel like the, the even this part is like on there. It's not like a iron on kind of thing. Oh, no, I'm sorry. It is a T-shirt. I lied. I thought it was a tank top. It's not. So this is, it says Fleetwood Mac Dreams, and it's really nice. It's very, very nice. Like, this part is not, you know how sometimes when you get tops from Timu, like, this, this part feels like a sticker? That doesn't feel like this at all. It actually feels like it's in the fabric. It's really cute. It's really cute. So, yeah, I love that. Great quality. It actually feels like a t-shirt. Let me see if it says what... Because they always fool me and they'll throw some polyester stuff at me and uh, I'm like, is that really polyester or not? Let me see if I can find a tag. Okay. The tag says 95% polyester and 5% spandex. Well, I would never know this is polyester. It feels like cotton, but it is a little stretchy, which is awesome. So yeah, I love that. Absolutely love that. Okay, I think there's just a couple more items to go. This was so stinging cute. It was $1.98. It was a necklace and earring set, and it's like a pineapple. I thought it would be so cute for summer. Um, I love pineapple anything. I have, a pair, I have a pair of pineapple earrings that are just adorable, too, so that I could wear with this. But it comes with, it comes with earrings and a necklace, which is awesome. Now, the chain is not the greatest, and the chain fell, like, right off of here. So, so anyway, this is what the necklace looks like. It's really pretty. Really, really pretty. On a silver chain, it's got like a silver, um, you know, it's it's all silver. Well, I mean, probably not real silver, but it's got like yellow rhinestones and some, the green part is painted, green part, I should say. And then oh, here are the earrings. If I can show them. Aren't they adorable? Like stinking adorable. I, I absolutely love that. And you get all three pieces for $1.98. I mean, that's that's really good, I think. You know, super cute would be a really pretty gift for someone for a birthday in the summer. And, you know, I know that these packages that this stuff comes in, it's like, mm, who wants to get a package like that? But put this stuff in like a jewelry box. Get get some jewelry boxes off of Timu, too. And then, you know, you can put it in a jewelry box and you would know. Okay, let's see if this is the last item. I think that it is. Okay, last item is this sweater. Um, I will, again, I'll put a picture up of this at some point while I'm talking and I got this for 10.29 the color is space gray ooh space gray 
little boutique cloth. <laughs> I call them boutique cloths. Um, it's just like a really big open weave. This looks like a half shirt. I think April might have one of these. April Rain. It's not, the sleeves are not very long, but it is kind of short a little bit. I don't think it, I don't know. Is it not really, but it would definitely, I'm afraid if I wash this, it'll really, really shrink up. But you know, you wear like a nice tank top under it or something, even if it was shorter, you know, no big deal. But yeah, this is the color. It's like space gray. It's see-through. Um, but yeah, I'll put a picture up. It was only 10 bucks. I thought I'll try it, wear a little tank top under it and yeah, should be good to go. All right, so thank you so much for stopping by and watching my haul. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for coming. Please like and subscribe if you are so inclined. And I hope you have a super awesome day and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.